Well, hello there. Have you ever wanted to have a ghost saber as your hunter pet? Well, you're in luck. This was a viewer suggestion by Guillermo Luna. I'm sorry if I said your name wrong. I tried my best. <laughs> but this hunter pet, honestly, is extremely fun to get. I've never actually really heard of it. I don't really quest out here, so I, I think that's why I never knew. But I want to share it with y'all because this is actually really fun to acquire and it's a really nice looking hunter pet. To get started, we want to head over here to Kalendor and you want to make your way over here to the Dark Shore. Now, if the burning of Tidrasil has already happened, you want to come over here to this location and talk to the Keeper of Time and have them revert everything back to before the burning of Tidrasil. Once you've done that, you want to head over here to this location. There's going to be a whole bunch of ruins and there's going to be trolls that are running around trying to do some archaeology. Once you've gotten to this location, you want to just go ahead and look around all the little piles of building ruins and everything else because we are looking for little cat statues. Once you have discovered a cat statue, you want to make sure that you dismiss your pet, your current pet that you have, and you want to click the statue. Now two things are going to happen. Either you're going to end up with a gray item of a cat figure, or the ghost saber is going to spawn. Now, I really liked doing this because it really felt like a hide-and-go-seek. You know, just gotta look around, use your eyeballs. There's no add-on or anything else that can help you find these, or at least not to my knowledge. But it was honestly just kind of fun to use my brain and try to look around and see if I can find where are the cat statues. On my third cat statue, I clicked it and the ghost saber ended up spawning. Once it spawns, you just want to go ahead and tame it like usual. Nothing too fancy required. And just like that, you now have a sweet ghost saber, and I gotta admit, I'm excited about this one. The specialization for this cat is ferocity. Its tamed abilities are cat-like reflexes, claw, prowl, growl, and dash, and its diet is meat and fish. <laughs> I wanted to say flesh, that'd be kind of weird. But the also fun thing about this ghost saber is you don't have to be in any special class to do it. So you could either be in marksman, beastmaster, or survival. It doesn't really matter. And that's it. That's how you acquire the ghost saber hunter pet. Now, if you have a hunter pet suggestion or just have a hunter pet where you're just like, this is amazing. I want to show it to everybody. Go ahead and leave it down in the comments and I'll put it on the books for a future video. I'm extremely excited for the expansion to come out so I can start making videos about hunter pets in Dragonflight. I look forward to showing you everything that I can find. And of course, if you find something as well, let me know. Well, that's it for this video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. I really do hope you did. If you did, please give it a like. And if you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I make videos like this every week. Also, I started streaming on Twitch, so check that out. Or not. It's your choice. Well, I look forward to seeing you in the next Hunter Pet video. Bye for now.